Hello, my name is Gennard Garcia, Technical Marketing Engineer, BADC, Concentration with Full Secure. Um, I'm here today to give you a brief overview of the connection analytics that we offer in our virtual traffic manager. Um, the connection analytics is very important in analyzing some of the issues that you may have to your connection. So I think this is uh, necessary and necessity towards uh, doing some debugs and actually a system admin would need in order to figure out where the issues would be uh, in case there is an issue. So the first thing that I would like to uh, provide you is to pretty much enabling uh, the connection analytics details. Uh, without enabling this feature, you're not going to have uh, such detailed uh, information in terms of the connection or the traces that you may collect or you may uh, generate uh, when a request comes in. So the first thing we need to do is go into our VTM. This is a standard uh, Mozilla browser. So I'm accessing one of my demo servers. Uh, this is the VTM. So I'm logging in and pretty much this is an IAS application that I've generated and developed. I uh, use most of these demos using IAS because it's simplified and easy to, to manage. Uh, and you can see the actual load balancing. So in terms of connection analytics, the first thing you need to do is go into the vServer and uh, you click edit. There are different options. Uh, in this one, we're basically using HTTP. In all the In all the protocols that you may enable, you will see all these, uh, you, you will see the connection analytics uh, that is gonna be supported within the virtual server. So in this virtual server, we need to edit and see some of the features and options that we need in order to generate the connections details. Uh, so from here, uh, this is required. Uh, on the connections page, you need to enable yes, and then uh, uh, recent, Connection enable, you have to enable this and save all. This is required. And also, if you need some request traces, this one has to be enabled as yes and yes here. If you want some transaction meta export, you can enable this. But you know, in order to get the basic uh, traces and uh, connection uh, details, all you need to do at the minimum would be this two uh, sets of features enabling a solution. Now, Let's go on to the actual activity, okay? So if we go down to the connections, all right. It will give you some details of the actual collections and all you have to do is click the magnifying glass. It gives you the connection summary, the time, the protocol that's used from via and you know what type of virtual server it is this is the name that it hit when the request was uh, initiated and then uh, the response code is a 200 okay which is you know a successful uh, request and then if you drill down here it gives you the details of the TCP connection since we have um, uh, uh, Certificate within this uh, uh, virtual server, uh, we have example.com. It did initiate a, a TLS handshake, as you can see here, and it takes a uh, pretty quick, uh, less than 1.25, approximately 1.3 seconds, um, millisecond rather. And then you can see the TCP client request start, and then from there, you got your uh, TCP client close. Uh, pretty much just ending the session from here. So you can see from the timeline uh, from 0 0.001 millisecond all the way to 1.536 millisecond. So that's basically uh, what entailed. Uh, these are, you know, uh, these are required uh, timelines as you can see when you do some debugging. So you can see at least what's taking forever to, to uh, <coughs> process or proceed. And then you can also get into the details of the request details. Uh, you know, it's HTTP GET, 
uh, the host, uh, which is dot ninety one, and then if you go to the response side, the response side says it's HTTP two hundred, and the server that's being used is an IAS eight dot five version, and the time, and then uh, you know the status connection, which is closed. So these are very important key in terms of uh, using the application. So if you have any further questions, I hope you enjoy watching this uh, video blog that I created. Uh, other question, any other questions, feel, feel free to contact the TME team at Full Secure. Thank you.